I, I don't know where he's at. Um, that's confidential. We know where he is. Thanks for joining us here on 23 ABC News. I'm your senior reporter, Veronica Morley. It's been nearly two months since Kern County Sheriff deputies were called out to Kern County District 2 Supervisor Zach Scrivener's to Hatchby home. We were there as investigators went in and out of the home, removing several items. While the investigation is underway to determine if any criminal charges will be filed, a family law hearing took place on Thursday. While I was in the courtroom, Zach Scrivener was nowhere to be found. Attorneys representing Zach and Christina Scrivener attended the hearing regarding a domestic violence restraining order. However, neither Zach nor Christina themselves were in attendance. Ultimately, attorneys agreed on a six-month postponement while the criminal investigation unfolds. In April, sheriffs responded to the supervisor's home following a call from Kern County District Attorney and Zach's aunt, Cynthia Zimmer. The following day, Sheriff Donnie Youngblood confirmed the investigation stemmed from an altercation between Scrivener and his children over allegations of sexual abuse. The sheriff said Scrivener was stabbed by one of his children. Before April, Christina had filed for divorce in March. Following the sheriff's statements, attorney H.A. Sala announced his representation of Scrivener, refuting all allegations of abuse and saying the stabbing was a result of a mental episode he experienced due to his pending divorce. Court records show Christina Scrivener filed an emergency protection order and a domestic violence restraining order following the incident. A temporary restraining order was granted in May. Due to Scrivener's personal relation to the DA, the criminal investigation is under review by the Attorney General's office. The next family law hearing is set for December 2nd. Christina Scrivener's attorney said that that hearing will likely be another status hearing to figure out how to move forward amid the criminal investigation.